Yo, what is going on, guys? It's Al here, and welcome to the first episode of Realms SMP. I know it's been a minute, but you know, we're back on the grind. But if you guys want to see some Realms SMP streams, make sure to go follow my Twitch. That's where I'm going to be streaming Realms SMP and getting most of my clips from. It's on the screen right now, it's also in the description. It's just twitch.tv slash it's all very simple and easy. And yeah, let's get right into it. So, in this episode, I don't know if you guys watched my application video, but I actually made a bet with the owners of Realms SMP. And basically I said, if I were to get into Realms SMP the first 24 hours, I would get a netherite pickaxe and a netherite sword. And the crazy thing is that I actually managed to do it in like four hours, like three and a half to four hours, which is absolutely crazy. But yeah, let's get right into the video and I'll show you guys how I did it. All right, so when we were first doing our introductions and stuff like that, we actually got some starter tools. I already started off with an iron sword and an iron pickaxe and iron armor, which helped me out a ton. I also got carrots from the community farm, and that's when I set out on my journey to walk a couple hundred blocks away from spawn because I was guessing that all the diamonds from the spawn area have already been taken out since this world has been this world has been used for almost two years which is absolutely crazy so i just started moving away from spawn to try and find diamonds all right so honestly this part did not take too too long it only took about 15 minutes of going through caves and strip mining with one iron pickaxe we were able to find six diamonds and all we really needed was five for another right pickaxe and another right sword and you know we have one left over for whatever we needed to do so six was a good amount and once we have the diamonds we can go get beds and find netherite and you know continue to convert it into netherite tools and then we were going to be able to finish the challenge but this took a bit longer than i expected but once we found the diamonds i already knew that this was going to be way easier than i expected so after finding the diamonds i went to the main part of the realms where you know everyone has their builds and i actually found this little contraption built by tim where we could gamble iron ingots for gold and possibly diamonds so i tried my luck and then i realized i could use the gold for gold armor so the piglins don't attack me and that was just like five that was five head iq and i kept doing it and everyone was calling me a gambler and you know they were saying bras and all that stuff but i was gonna use everything to speed this up because this was gonna take a while if i did not use this if you play survival you know that beds are the way to go in the nether because they explode on contact so my idea was to go to the richest man on the server who had a huge sheep farm and i would just shear them for free and get a ton of beds and it worked out perfectly because i found the sheep farm i got an inventory worth and more of beds which came in really handy because netherite was a lot harder to find than i expected i have not played survival since before the nether update so i've never found netherite fully survival before and wow wow that's all i can say wow so after voyaging for a couple hundred blocks and using the bed method i didn't know where netherite actually started on the netherworld because this world was made before the nether update so i just had to use the beds and pray that i would find another right and when i found one man this is my reaction <gasps> i found one yo chat chat i found one there's hope so after finding that ancient debris block i was feeling really really good about myself because i was finally in the chunks that spawned them and i actually found a vein uh, oh my god <laughs> yo what so a vein of three i was completely mind blown after finding that vein of three i ran out of bed so i couldn't use that method anymore so i tried strip mining and i actually found one in my path as i was strip mining the amount of luck i've been having is just insane and don't think the luck ended there because I went to go mine it and there was a whole nother ancient debris behind it. I was 
Oh my goodness. So I ended up having to go back to the overworld because I ran out of beds. I was running out of food. My pickaxe was breaking. So I had to go get more of that stuff. And I also needed two more netheracks. So I, you know, I had to go back either way. So I went back, got everything. And within 10 minutes, I found the missing two ancient debris. And that's what I needed to complete everything. So I make it back to my base and I'm smelting the ancient debris and I have my diamond pickaxe and my diamond sword at the ready because, uh, oh my goodness, like this stream has been going on, you know, it's been going on for a minute, but we finally got the netherite ingots and all we need to do is find a smelting table. And I remembered Brandon having one because I was watching his stream and I was like, that's going to come in handy if I, if I get in. So, um, I travel on to his place get to brandon's place i see the smelting table i'm ready we're finally able to complete the challenge you know i said i would complete it in 24 hours and i completed it in less in basically three hours like basically it was basically three hours like if we're subtracting everything else but there we go we got the netherite sword and now we you know we got to do the netherite pickaxe and there we go guys we completed the challenge netherite sword netherite pickaxe Oh my gosh, that was that was low-key stressful because I felt like that stream would probably take in like 10 hours, but you know, due to my you know my five head strats and you know my one million IQ, I was able to get it done and execution was perfect. But anyways, that's pretty much it for episode one of the Realms SMP. I'm super excited to start this series realms smp you know we going back on the grind we're recording videos streaming we're gonna go crazy especially with summer right around the corner like come on now but yeah make sure you guys definitely do drop a like and subscribe if you guys are excited for more videos like this thank you guys so much for 5,000 subscribers like you guys are literally insane make sure you guys go follow my twist that's where i'm gonna be streaming realms smp as well as the hive and make sure to go join my discord like that's where i talk to you guys and you know we hang out and have fun but yeah, that's pretty much it for today's video and I'll catch you guys later. Peace.